okay uh, so in this video we are going to set up our project so i have used uh, three softwares uh, intellij idea uh, webstorm and uh, exam okay so we will create our spring springboard application using Inter intellij idea so now click on new project okay and select uh, springboard you will not get a spring initializer here you have to install the plugin after that uh, you will uh, see spring initializer here okay so uh, here you will click uh, plugin and spring initializer and you will see a plugin here and from there this one and uh, you can install it and then you, know, you will able to see the plugin there okay so select the spring initializer uh, click on next Uh, select uh, Java version uh, 11 then you have to um, give add two dependencies like MySQL so we can we will be able to connect MySQL from our application and so we are using REST API so we have to include a Spring Boot web okay now click on next give a name okay So now click on create. So it will take uh, some time uh, to um, uh, configure the dependencies. Okay. In that time, uh, we will create our uh, Angular uh, front end. Okay. So here you have to select uh, you have to load the Maven project. So click on load. So now uh, open a command prompt and select directory where you want to create a project. So I am creating in this directory. So ng new uh, YouTube. YouTube. Active. Okay. So it will also take some time uh, to create it. So and now and the third software. Okay, let me configure it first. So we are using SaaS in this project. Okay, so it will take some time to uh, create it. Okay, and after that we will open it in uh, VS Code and WebStorm. In VS Code, we will write the HTML part, uh, and in uh, WebStorm, we will write the TypeScript part. Okay. Now, uh, open the exam. Uh, so, click on Start. So, it will start the Apache server. Click on Start, or it will start the MySQL server. Uh, here, you have to open the database. So, click on localhost. So it will open the local host and click on PHP my admin. Okay, so here you have to click a database. Sorry, here you have to create a database. So create database YouTube okay. and press control enter so it will execute it. And now here if you will double click it. It will select the database and when you will click uh, SQL, uh, it will open a window where you will write some code to execute uh, and you will be able to create your table. This is the schema of the table, okay? So, can press Control Enter, so it will create the table, okay? So, we are done with our MySQL part, okay? Then so what is the status of our so I think it is ready so in the next uh, video uh, we will uh, create our REST API okay so see you in the next video